Hello all of you again. I hope that you are so fine. Today we are going to see new grammar uh, lesson in unit 9. Holiday plans. So uh, this grammar is about practicing can I. Okay. It is about practicing question forms with can. Okay. Let's, uh, let's take a look at this picture. We have four students here saying four sentences but who says the first sentence who says the second who says the third and who says the fourth in order to know let's listen to this audio students book page 107 one look read and write the names then listen and check then, what would you like to do tomorrow? Can we visit Grandpa in the afternoon? Fine. Kate, what about you? What would you like to do? Can I build a tree house tomorrow afternoon? Yes, I can help you. Emma, what would you like to do? Can I go horse riding tomorrow morning? Well. Okay. Tom, what would you like to do? Can we have pizza at Ruby's tomorrow evening? Tomorrow is Tuesday. We can go and have pizza on Wednesday, okay? Yes, great. Okay, so I hope now that you know who is Emma and who, who said what said Emma, what Ben said, what Kate said, and what Tom said. Okay, so all of them, they use can, I, or can we. It means they ask questions using can. Now let's see how to ask questions using can or with can. We have, can I go horse riding tomorrow morning? Can we visit grandpa and grandma in the afternoon? So we ask questions using can. Can I? Can we? So this is question or request. We are demanding something. We are requesting for something. Okay. Request it means and demand. Nibhal wahed demand. Niken talabu wahed talab. Can I go horse riding tomorrow morning? Can we visit grandpa and grandma in the afternoon? So. Look at the form of the question here, or the request. In this form we have, we start with can, then the subject, I, we are subjects. Then the verb, but in infinitive, go, visit. Then the object or the complement. We can have only the, object, uh, the, the objects, we can have objects and all the complements of the object. So, here we have, I repeat, can plus subject plus verb in infinitive plus the object or the complement. And the last thing, it's important here, question mark. The question mark. So, I repeat this example. Can I go horse riding tomorrow morning? So we have can plus I is the subject, go is the verb in infinitive, horse riding tomorrow morning is the object or the complement. If we say horse riding, it's only object, but all this sentence is complement. And the last one, question mark. The same thing. Can we visit grandpa and grandma in the afternoon? We have can plus subject we plus the verb visit in infinitive grandpa and grandma in the afternoon complement and the last one question mark. Okay, so in our meeting we are going to ask and answer using this form. What would you like to do in the holidays? 
can I visit my grandpa and my grandma? This is an example. Or, can I go learn swimming? Or, can I do my homework? And so on and so forth. So next time, inshallah, in our meeting, we are going to ask and answer using can. Okay, so see you then, inshallah. Good luck.